The dinosaurs at Dinosaur Island are staying put. They're supposed to be moved out after Labor Day weekend, but they've been so popular. The zoo is keeping the exhibit for more visitors to check out. That's right. The dinosaur exhibit will now be open through October 27th, which is great. And we're live at the zoo, out of the zoo for Zoo Monday with the zoo's Susie Rapp. And Susie, we were looking at a creature a minute ago that I'm not buying it. I mean, it looked right. like it could have been a dinosaur, but, but what is that thing out there with you today? Well, obviously I have the T-Rex. This is Rex above me. He's he's here, but this little guy is actually alive. This is a red tegu named Tango from Argentina. And, if, you know, I wanted to bring a reptile, Mike and Tracy, because a lot of people don't realize how closely related the birds and the reptiles and the dinosaurs actually were. I mean, reptiles have been around for millions of years. And you can kind of see the resemblance when you look at Tango. Can you see the resemblance? I can. Yeah. That thing's a ball of fire, Susie. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Actually, you know why he's not, Mike? <laughs> Too hot yes, for he's him? A reptile and he's, he's a cold-blooded animal, and he's got the sun shining on him right now. Uh -huh. oh. So cold-blooded animals, their body temperature is according to their surroundings. So they are one of the true hibernators that we have here in Ohio. You know, those of you who fear your snakes and turtles and everything, you don't need to worry about them in the wintertime because they <laughs> are hibernating. But Tango's enjoying the sun. He's absorbing that warmth. And his body temperature is going to read very much similar to the temperatures around us. Today being a hot day, Tango's happy. And of course, this T-Rex, he's pretty happy as well. But we did want to let people know we have decided to keep dinosaurs. We're going to keep them through October 27th, which is Boo at the Zoo. We also want to remind people, those of you who haven't come out and uh, gotten to see the dinosaurs, we're still open till 7 o'clock this week, Mike. But after Labor Day weekend, our hours are changing. They're going from 10 to 5. So if you have some youngsters or after school, you still have plenty of time this week to come out here. It's $2 for mem people who are have zoo members, and it's $3 for those who don't. It's a really cool exhibit. We have 25 animatronic dinosaurs for people to see. So we want you to come out and see them. And they will be on weekends too, but you're gonna wait in line on the weekend. Susie, tell us before you go, how surprised are you by the reaction and the approval to the uh, dinosaur exhibit? You know, you know what, Tracy? People have loved this exhibit. I mean, there's even talk of maybe someday making a permanent dinosaur exhibit around here. It's been very, very popular, far exceeded any of our expectations. I mean, I'm sitting here watching these kids go around in their faces, and they love it. So come out and see it.